What's up guys, it's me again. I know, long time no see. Oh, what's up? Uh, today, it's a beautiful, lovely day. Guaranteed, it's like 93 degrees. I don't know if you can see that. But today, I thought, let's spend this beautiful day at the park. I know, right? This special park right here has football cages, soccer cages. So yes, today, I'm about to be playing some of this football right here. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Hopefully, it's not too busy. For all my football players out there, this is the definition of bliss. Maybe one person playing football as well down there, but no one on this football field. Peace, quiet, where you can take out your emotions on the field. Corner, take it quick. Are the Barcelona fans triggered yet? Now this may sound like retarded logic here, but think here. Who is the best midfielder of our generation? Luka Modric, he's Croatian. Last season, the best striker in Europe, who is now at Real Madrid, Luka Jovic. Guaranteed he's having a horrible season now, getting injured, breaking his foot, falling off a wall. But this really, right here, doesn't have to do with football, but basketball. Who is the best rookie in the NBA right now? Luka Doncic. They're all named Luka. My name is Luka. Luka Modric has probably one of the best... Let me breathe for a minute. <sighs> Luka Modric has probably one of the best long shots a midfielder has. Luka Doncic's three-pointers, uh, they're better than James Harden's, I'll say that. And Luka Jovic, he's a prolific striker. My name is Luka. Not like the song. So let's see if that logic complies. <laughs> oh, crossbar! In come the edgy teenage group. Lord. How to take free kicks like Cristiano Ronaldo. Now this goal is probably one of my least favorite goals ever scored. Well, something like it, but uh, if you watch the World Cup Final, uh, you'll know. Unbelievable. This is a football pitch, not a cannabis ground. You fools, why are you traveling? You idiots. Now that father and son time have left, it's all but me on this pitch. God, I'm lonely. Introducing the next Luka Modric. Well, I mean... Eh, I'll cut that out. Introducing the next Luka Modric. Bad touch? We can fix that. You already know. Also, shoutouts to the footballers out there that can produce quick touches and still do a beastly shot i mean i just did one there but it seems impossible but at the same time it's possible all right boys and girls it's time for a little water break. A little water break time cheers empty the trash can over there i'll throw it later but the key is don't drink too much water or else you're gonna feel full during the game you're gonna get sick you're gonna feel pain probably. So drink water and also spit some out at the same time. It's like a reward factor in your brain. I read that somewhere online, but drink not a lot of water, but stay hydrated. That's your uh, health tip for the day. I seriously cannot get over this view. It's not much to some of you, but I was, I'm was i from Minnesota originally. I would much rather take desert sand mountains and shit like this than Grass and cornfields and cornfields and cornfields and cornfields. It's annoying. Uh, this is a refreshing change of scenery. Anybody wants to alleviate my loneliness, uh, Olympia State Park, Las Vegas. Uh, if you go to college, uh, hit, hit me up on Instagram. We'll, we'll, we'll kick it sometime. Did I say Olympia State College? I meant Olympia State Park. That's the name of this place. Uh, if you're in college, uh, hit me up. We can, we can kick it sometime. We can hang out. I, I, I need friends.
leave a comment down below which World Cup was your guys' favorite. Now, I've only seen the 2014 and 2018 World Cup, but 2018 so far is my absolute favorite because Croatia made the World Cup final. Should have won it. Screw you, France. Screw you, FIFA. But aside from that, this World Cup was awesome. This World Cup was awesome. Also, in other recent news, uh, the Bundesliga is coming back this weekend. God, thank you. The Bundesliga is coming back. I want to give a shout-out to my man, Ivan Perisic, at loan on Bayern Munich. One of his favorite goals, one of his favorite goals to score is to go down the wing. Like the whole left side of the pitch on the wing. Just keep going until he reaches into the box and then just usually go for the corner, but something like that. I want to give also a shout out to the uh, John Marshall High School boys soccer team. Not the not the John Marshall in California, Texas, New York, or whatever, but the one in Rochester, Minnesota, my hometown. Those guys pretty much rejected me from the team. Cut me my junior year, bench warmed me my freshman year, giving me minimal play time. Sophomore year, I couldn't try out because I was in Europe. Senior year, well, that was pretty much the same. So to them, I say, go fuck yourselves and suck my dick. And also to the haters that say the same. Because they missed out on some generational talent. That squad was missing my freshman year. We did good. We were on a kind of a losing streak. But come on now. Now y'all suck. I was the missing link to that team. But you fucking rejected me. Because this, you missed out on some generational talent. Some of you are cool. I respect you. But there are just some of you that can suck my dick. And I just punch you square in the face if I ever see you again. Because this... You missed out on some generational talent right there. Fuck you. Also, uh, the coach, I forgot to mention, the coach of my freshman year, he can also go fuck himself. Because he was also a huge reason of why I didn't get any playtime that year. And also the, the scouting coaches, I think, my junior year are trying out. They, oh, <laughs> they can go fuck themselves. But to my, the... The coach my freshman year, no disrespect to the coach's granddaughter. I respect her immensely. She's the same age as me. She played soccer too, but she's good. The coach can go fuck himself. No respect, disrespect to her. I respect her immensely, but seriously, him, he can really fall off a cliff. Watch closely now. <sighs> yeah, you get my point. Fuck them entirely. Also, I had to move because Mr. Reggaeton... Check, check, one, two, three, pop, pop, guima shop, the BS turn up, Jamaica man. Shut up, so. I'm gonna do a couple more, then I'm gonna head home. It's 6.15, I gotta go eat dinner soon, so let's, uh, let's enjoy this. All right, guys, I'm headed off home now. I stayed for much longer than I needed to. Let's go. I'm home now. Oh, good grind, just ate some dinner. Overall, very good day. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. Sorry for the sporadic upload schedules. This quarantine, the Vatican start opening up now. We're in phase one, soon to be phase two by the end of May. We'll see, but leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See you then.